mostly draw from the basic NCR army. A trooper who shows exceptional skill at fighting and scouting can be nominated for the training. A couple dozen, I'd say. Most of them posted at stations like this one. We either man the station or patrol the immediate area. Nah, I shouldn't have said anything in the first place. I'd rather not get you into the habit of crossing the NCR. <laughs> well, welcome back, everybody. That guy doesn't want to give me shit because he's cheap and his breath probably really stinks. So, we'll be heading out of here and continuing our quest towards Novak. And I'll probably be skipping, well, I will be skipping a very, very, um, fun quest, per se. Just so I can access the implant doctor. And once I access the implant doctor, I will get enough money to max out my int. And then I will go for luck, and then I'll get everything else, and then we can continue. But for now, we're just going to bum rush over there. And avoid those ways there just to get radiation for no reason. Well, actually, I think that's a box over there, so I'll show you. Yeah, see, you'll just get radiation. And yeah, that's not good. So you're gonna start running to areas with radiation soon. No bueno. Drink some of this pink lemonade. Uh, even Mr. Red needs some fuel before Mr. Blue does. Oh, there's Reptar. And this is when you get the Black Mountain radio signal, if that's what you fancy. Making sure that dumb robot is still following me. A few houses here and there, but it's just in order for now. And here we go. We are officially in Novak. Yippee freaking Skippy. There's a random Brahmin. Don't listen to a word Novak says. I don't think he ever sleeps, so it's no wonder he spouts nothing but nonsense. Well, all right, I'll be sure to do that. And there's Reptar. Let's see what else is around here first. There's a lot of electronics, it looks like. Toolbox. Well, just for the experience, I'll open it up, but that's about it. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm evil now. Oh, I'm evil. And there's a reload bench, and I want to say it's a workbench. Yeah, it is, if that's what you fancy on doing. And uh, let's go over here, and there is Victor randomly. Why are you here, Victor? Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit if it ain't my old friend from Good Springs. What the hell are you doing here? Don't rightly know. I just got the notion to make my way to New Vegas. Reckon I'll find out when I get there. Stop lying. No, Vic? Nice enough place, I suppose. But between you and me, when I roll into town, my skin start to itch. Watch yourself. Likewise, friend, likewise. Is there anything old Vic can do you for? Well, this ain't New Vegas, but I reckon you can find what you need here. Try the office out front. No, don't believe I did. But you might ask around. The Novak folk usually see anyone traveling this way. Be seeing you. Well, Victor, you're always randomly showing up. Let's talk to this person. Mm. Oh, it's not stealing? Well, I'll be taking it then. Uh, there 
there she goes. Hey there. Well, welcome to you. You look tired from the road. Why don't you relax a spell? Let this fine town take care of you. Oh, what am I doing? I got to thinking about making a good impression and plain forgot to tell you my name. I'm Jeannie May. I take care of folks here at the motel, long as they aren't troublemakers. We're in a little desert oasis, name of Novak. This is the Dino Delight Motel, and it's mine. Well, there's Dinky, the town mascot. He's a sight. You probably already saw him when you came in, but you can go up inside, too. Up the roadways to the west, there's Repcon. That's the old rocket factory. There's been some sinister characters out there lately, so you may want to stay clear. Other than that, nothing to do but take it easy and enjoy good company. Well, up north a ways, you'll see a big tower. That's Helios 1. Used to be a power plant in its day. And there's a town just east of here called Nelson. Used to be such a quaint little place until those slavers took it over. But we got our wonderful snipers keeping an eye in that direction, and so far, the slavers have left us alone. I just know what I've heard. There's supposed to be some ghouls that went in a while back. Ever so often, there'll be a commotion from that direction. Explosions and such. Watch out for strangers. I hope you're finding every... Go see Cliff Briscoe at the Dino Bike gift shop and tell him I sent you. I think he gets lonely standing around in that dino belly all day. He'll be glad for the company. I'll be sure to do that. Well, he might have been wearing a fancy outfit, but he wasn't any kind of gentleman to me. Had his nose stuck so high in the air you couldn't see it above the clouds. City folk, they always think they deserve better than what they got. Those hoodlums he was with seem to know Manny for some reason. He's our daytime sniper up in the dinosaur's mouth. Well, let's see. Dusty McBride's been losing some Brahmin, but that's probably the heat more than anything. Honestly, it's been real quiet. Ranger Andy's still hurt, but we got these two gentlemen snipers watching the road day and night, keeping the trash out of Novak. They've been a blessing. You can jump out the window for all I care, mister. You've got no right to come in here and start criticizing our town. Folks work hard to keep it clean and safe. We do the best we can. But still, there's always some of you finicky types that there's just no pleasing. Well, it is. Not everybody appreciates it like they ought to. All right. Well, I think that's a fine idea. I'll give you a good flat rate, and you can stay as long as you like. At least until the busy season comes. Sound good? Oh. Yeah, don't bother. You'll get the room for free later. <laughs> yeah. All right, so um, I got to definitely read over my notes, because what I'm about to do is very sticky. And I don't want to proceed with a certain quest until I make sure I do it. So I'm going to just take advantage of my notes while it's loading here. Let's see. Okay, after reading my notes, I see what I have to do. So, first and foremost, do not, do not go into this house. You will be talking to an NPC and you will not be able to do a companion quest later, so don't go in that house. There's a person in there called Ranger Jackson and then he's going to teach you a unarmed move and if you don't care about the companion quest, then don't worry about it. But I do, so I'm not going to be talking to him. But I will be robbing this guy. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I'm evil, I'm evil. Okay, I get it, I get it. Sunset, sunset. See how evil am I? Now I think about it. I'm pretty evil by now, aren't I? The hell is that thing at? The 
hell does it show how evil you are? It's somewhere around here. Oh, I'm an adventurer. Okay, that's that's good. Whatever. How you do? Welcome to the Dino Bite gift shop. My name's Cliff. If you're here for the T-Rex figurines, you're just in time. There's still a few left. Bless her. Seems like every traveler I get in here tells me the same thing. They see the sign and think, gift shop? That's just too good to be true. But Jeannie May always points them back in my direction. Well, a friend of Jeannie's is a friend of mine. And my friends get a discount at my store. Okay, so... Well, there's T-Rex figurines, of course. That's our bread and butter. We also have an assortment of the Repcon factory souvenirs, rockets, things of that nature. Guns? I, uh, well, yeah, I guess I might have a few. Darn it, no one ever buys the T-Rexes. They're scale replicas of the real thing. Every detail. Got a liquid in them that makes them glow. From what I hear, Repcon used to give them out on tours of their HQ up in Henderson. But I guess they had to stop after the first few kids thought they were filled with Nuka-Cola and drank it down. The papers had a name for the condition and everything. They called it the Repcon Shakes. Those were bad times for Robco. Well, they unloaded what they had left on the dino light as a tax write-off, but that was before my time. Plenty of demand for them, seeing as how they're one-of-a-kind collector's items, but I might still have some in back. Sure thing. Um, All right, let's see what this guy has. It's not much of a discount. Power fist, huh? That gun. Let's see, I just want sugar bombs. Yes, just give me. I'll tell you why we need that later. Take some stem packs. Locksmith readers. You can always do that. It's primarily all you want from this guy. Don't bother with those reptar craps. And you could be a jackass and open up that door, but you don't want to do that yet, so don't worry about that either. What's going on, man? I'm Manning. I'm on security detail here. You see a rifle barrel sticking out of the dinosaur's mouth, you got a 50-50 shot It's me. Otherwise, it's boom. You name it. Anything that comes within a thousand yards that looks like trouble. Lately, we've been getting ghouls coming from the road to Repcon. The hell is that in front of its face? Last couple days. Oh, his the face. The big threat is the Legion coming from the east. If they decide to attack with a full force, they'll run us over. So far, we've been lucky. Um, hold up. Oh, damn it, Eddie. Alright. What's going on, man? Boone's a sniper, same as me. Used to spot for him when we were enlisted with the NCR. After we got out, I talked him into settling down here. So, here we are. I'd introduce you, but, uh, we're not so friendly right now. Me and his wife, we didn't see eye to eye on some things. We had some pretty big arguments. One day, she turns up missing, and he hasn't said a word to me since. Man, you name it. See, I grew up in North Vegas, me and my cousins. We were some bad seeds. Got in with a gang. I loved it. Then something happened, and I couldn't handle it anymore. So, I enlisted, earned my future, brought down my best friend to share that future with me. And here was this woman, who was too good for it, trying to take him away. So yeah, I didn't see eye to eye with the bitch. Well, all right. Were they tough? I was in the cons, man. It doesn't get any badder. Sure I don't. What do you want with them? Must be something pretty important to be chasing a guy like that. Well, listen, I can definitely help you find him, but I've got problems of my own. Maybe we can do a trade. You need my help, and there's something I need, too. Mm, okay, let's just confirm bachelor. Yeah, I... Everybody depends on you, you 
you know? But they don't ask you about how you feel, what you worry about. There's something I like about you. You just seem really understanding. I was gonna ask you for a favor, but I'll just tell you what you wanna know. The guy you're looking for, Benny, he was traveling with some members from my old gang. They were going to Boulder City. No clue. I know Benny hadn't paid up yet. Maybe that was where they were supposed to get square. It's straight up Route 93 from here. Just keep following the road north. Hey, I know you've got no reason to help me out now, but you seem really nice. Could I at least tell you about the problem we've got here? See? I was right about you. Novak, it's home for me now. I want that to be for good. I like it here, and I've left too many homes behind. But the only resource we got here is junk. Without that, people wouldn't have anything to trade. They'd all have to leave. We get most of it up the road from the old rocket test site, but a bunch of ghouls showed up one day and took it over. We can't get in there now. I would, but I've got to watch the road. Caesar's Legion has been taking territory just east of here. They took Nelson. If we let our guard down, they might attack. All it takes for the Legion is for them to sense weakness. Well, they gotta go, or this will be a ghost town before long. It doesn't matter to me what you do. As long as the ghouls are out of there, that's good enough for me. It'd mean a lot to me. Just head over to the Repcon test site west of here. See if you can get the ghouls out of there. Okay, so um, don't bother with the quest. If you don't have yeah. confirmed bachelor, though, you have to do the quest in order to technically continue the quest of where these guys are. But I have confirmed bachelor, so I can continue it. But before I do that, we shall recruit something new. Without spoiling it any more than I just accidentally hey, you did. Came back. Must be doing something right. But I'm Mr. Blaze, shut up, man. Don't matter what I'm doing. This is about me, not you. Alright, so let's read that note we got earlier from that sniper guy, I already forgot his name, Manny, Manny Fresh, eat at Rita's Cafe, open all night, alright, let's see here, Manny Vargas mentioned a sniper who works at night, and apparently his wife went missing, so let's make this the fast version of what I'm about to do. He's gonna wait here wait till midnight almost. Okay, obviously I can't add. Alright, good going. Alright, and down comes him. How you doing? Cliff, don't worry about Cliff. Wait, does he have hey there. him? If you wanna buy something from a shop, you'll have to Alright, screw you, whatever. And while he's gone from that, I will be... Nah, I think I'll still wait. I shall still wait. Yeah, I'll wait till after the quest. Screw it. someone I can trust. You're a stranger. That's a start. I said it was a start. This town, nobody looks me straight in the eye anymore. I want you to find something out for me. I don't know if there's anything to find, but I need someone to try. My wife was taken from our home by Legion slavers one night while I was on watch. They knew when to come, what route to take, and they only took Carla. Someone set it up. I don't know who. My wife's dead. I want the son of a bitch who sold her. Bring him out in front of the nest here while I'm on duty. I work nights. I'll give you my NCR beret to put on. It'll be our signal so I know you're standing with him. And I'll take care of the rest. I need to do this myself. 
Good. I'll make it worth your while. And one more thing. We shouldn't speak again. Not until it's over. No one in town knows that I know what happened to my wife. Best they never know. But the Legion will be after me next. I know, all right. That's all you need to know. Yeah. All right, so um, Bone wants us to find who killed his wife, but instead of going around like a chick without my head off and Mr. Red is quite lazy today, I'll just go straight to the solution right now. Yes, I I have my fair share of Inspector Gadgets before. Barely even got to talk this whole freaking episode. All the NPCs are taking up all my time. Not that Mr. Blue has too much to say. It's been kind of quiet lately. All right, Mr. Blue. Let us go to the solution. You can close your eyes if you don't want to know. But that's the only real secret I can give you. Oh, and make sure you have an intelligence of seven at least, minimum. I think seven. It might be six. And the old bitch isn't in here, so let's just go straight to the point. Oh, uh, come on. A little bit more. Thank you. And there we go. Bill of Sale. Alright, let's just read the Bill of Sale. And basically, it was Jeannie Mae Crawford that killed her. And yeah, she's the one who did the evil. The evil deed. So, now we just have to find Jeannie. We should be out around here somewhere, if I remember correctly. Load faster, game. Stupid fallout. All right, Genie, where the hell are you? Should be around here somewhere. Maybe I missed her. I think she's still in the house, actually. She's not outside yet. Yeah, she's still in here. My bad. Even a blue can make a mistake. Alright, Jeannie. I think you're in here, if I recall. No? Oh, what the hell? I thought there was another room. Okay, I lied. Alright, I lied. Whatever. Well, fuck it. I'm not open up the trash register. else in here well, since I open up the damn room again. No? Okay, whatever. Fair enough. A soft spot for snow globes, huh? Yeah, I got a soft spot for something else. Okay, Genie. Where the hell are you? This one is active. Had this. Oh! I like the damn quest. There we go. One for my baby. There we go. Alright, Jeannie. Where the hell are you, woman? Traveling around the world. Oh, this is a good thing I ran to her because, uh, She's another doctor, and I can use somebody to help What can me. I do for you? That's not so bad. I'll have you looking as good as new. I mean, what are the chances of me botching another routine procedure in the same day? All right, I'll just get my scalpel here. And, uh, did I need that sitting outside? Well, you know what? Free tennis shot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell are you going to do to me? Oh, God. What can I do for you? Um, do you have medical yeah, supplies? Yeah, I need sterile medical. Ah, uh, shut up. Just give me what you have. Alright, does she have any stim packs? Oh, yes, I, I do love my stim packs, so I'll be taking that. That's all I want from you. Give me a shot if you need anything. And Are my you radiation as well. Built up quite a radiation. And that shit is bugged, which annoys the hell out of me. She did not 
get rid of my radiation, did she? Okay, yeah, she did. Sometimes it's bugged, though, so you gotta watch out for that. She hasn't paid me. Between you and me, I don't think she's studied But yeah, she doesn't pay you sometimes. Oh, she doesn't heal your radiation. Sometimes you might have to do it multiple times, but I think that got patched. So, yeah, don't worry about it. But worry about it at the same time. Alright, this is not like I'm gonna be able to find this lady in this episode, unfortunately. Where the hell Jeannie is? So it looks like I have to do that off screen for now. Yeah, I'll just have to find her off screen. Now you get to wait till the next episode. Ha ha, cliffhanger, ha ha, cliffhanger. Uh, yeah, that's pretty, pretty funny. Pretty funny, Mr. Blue. Hey guys, we're on Facebook. Check the description of this video for the link to our new Facebook application. Subscribe and get our latest video updates posted right on the wall on your own Facebook page.